sub 305 today. I don't know about that low, but uh, maybe sub 310. They're taking over. It really seems like they are at this point. I can't seem to go a day without hearing something about VTubers either on Twitter or in chat or something. I've been getting, I've gotten recommended on YouTube VTubers playing OOT. There are speedrunning VTubers. Someone just posted about, there was apparently a, a VTuber at GDQ. And there's an OOT speedrunner VTuber also. Doesn't mean she watches VTubers. I have watched a few minutes of a VTuber playing OOT. They were playing on Wii U. It was sad. Dude, so many people have already recommended the VTuber for April Fools thing. I don't know about that. I am not going to be a Dampe VTuber for April Fools. How about this? For April Fools, I'll do Ocarina of Time 100% speedruns. Dude, I'm just not an April Fools person. Is that an April Fools joke? Yeah, totally. Dude. Dude. This is bad. Very bad. Ignore that. Warm up run. Gamble? What are you gonna gamble on? You guys just wanna gamble on everything. There's nothing to gamble on. Shut up. Oh my god. How about you go to your local casino? I'm not actually mad. It's just funny how much how much of an addiction you guys have. I didn't bring this upon myself, Twitch did. This is all Twitch's fault. Twitch is getting people addicted to gambling. Can we gamble on whether or not this run will be world recce? If you do, then we can't gamble for the rest of the run, because only one prediction can be going at once. So that would mean no Dampe and no will the run finish at adult. Gamble on if I'll be mean to chat. That would be an easy bet. Huh? How? Turbo is not allowed, no. Yes, tapping the button really fast like turbo is allowed, if you can do that with your hands. Which is Dan Paylock has been crazy over the last few days. Gee, that would sure be nice if I had some good luck. I don't think I've gotten better than like sixth try in a week. Probably more than a week. Glitchy hogging all the good luck. Dude, I get to Dampe all the time. I get like two runs to Dampe almost every day. I just haven't gotten one to Dampe today. No, the run is not dead. The run is not dead from being 24 seconds behind. If you warp into this cutscene as adult, you watch the cutscene as adult. I mean, the camera, the camera is placed in some interesting places as adult, but otherwise just works the same. All right, you can start gambling. Man, I can be like a minute ahead here. I can be like a minute ahead before Dampe, I can save three minutes at Dampe, I can save a minute at fishing, and I can save two to three minutes in adult. I got so much time to save. So my Dampe Lux recently has been painfully average. Nothing horribly bad, but nothing good in particular. Like I think my best one in the last week or two has been like sixth try. I was really hoping that I could then say, oh, never mind at first. But no. Doubters win. Come on, that's not interesting. 21. That's just bad. That's just bad enough to kill a run. That's not a fascinatingly bad Dampe. Just. It's just kill your run and nothing else special. That's a high pitched one. Power runs. Uh, because of you stealing my luck, I got 21st try Dampe, thanks. Got 7th, 15th, and 3rd today. <laughs> nice. I guess. I guess it's better than all the firsts you've been getting. I still have only had one single first. The entire time I've been running this route. Uh, if you want to know about what's happening in this run, do exclamation point FAQ. I should say that at GDQ. Just, just start my com commentary and say, okay, if you want to know what's going on, do exclamation point FAQ and I'm not going to explain anything else. Do I like video games? No, not really. They kind of suck. Fun fact, there used to be a route where if you failed that Saria song, your run would be over. 
Because you had a frozen timer at the time and failing Saria's song unfroze the timer. All right, gambling time. Dude, what if the gambling is making my Danpei's worse? What if it's affecting my Danpei look? All right, what's it gonna be this time? Okay. What was that, fifth try? Or six? What was it, five or six? Six, okay. Another average one. But it's fine. It's good enough. Congrats, believers. That was close. I was very close to just sliding into that Skulltula in midair and getting hit. I mean, it wouldn't have actually been that bad because I could just save and reset. It would lose like 30 seconds, but I mean, 30 seconds is bad, but it could be worse. All right, as long as this run finishes, I think it's very likely that this is at the very least sub 310. I think I really shouldn't lose so much time that as long as I finish, I don't get sub 310. Because like from this point to the end, the bigger, the bigger question is, do I crash rather than do I lose X amount of time? Like, if I finish, I'm not likely to lose more than a few minutes compared to my best. But it's more about does it crash or not. But just don't crash. Yeah, crash is instant dead run. There's no safety save in adult. You can't safety save at all because of Furrow's Wind on B. So if you crash, it's over. Or the odds that it crashes depends on who you ask. If you ask me, I think it's very low odds because I am very confident that I should never crash because all of the setups are easy. Um, there may be empirical data that disagrees with that, but uh, that is how I view it. Highlight videos would disagree. I disagree with the highlight videos. They're rigged. I mean, I've been doing really well in adult in my last few runs there, actually. And I've been practicing adult. Like, adult is my most practiced section of the run. And in my practice, I always do pretty well. Oh my god, he's doing them in like the worst places. Have I done any percent? Plenty. I just, uh, well, a long time ago I did it a lot and then I've done the most recent versions, but uh, not for very long because any percent sucks. I basically just done it. I basically just done the recent any percent to do it and then that's it. Long ago, I used to have the any percent record back in like 2012, and then I realized, wow, any percent's a bad category. I should run better categories. I was about to be mad. I'm mad anyway. Oh my god, come on. Are you serious? Get up! <laughs> Climb! Oh my god. Hey. How is this what I lose time on? <laughs> I cannot tell you how mad I am right now. There is no word to describe my rage. Climbing up the heart piece platform is surprisingly hard. You very often uh, fall and don't have enough time to jump slash on, especially with Bigoran Sword. With Master Sword it's easier, but Bigoran Sword takes longer to take out, which makes it harder to actually jump slash onto it. Oh my god, this was really a 30 second time loss. I don't think I'm gonna make it in time. I could have, but the only way to, the only way I would have made it is with a, just like a no scope shot. But uh, I missed. It's not that big of a deal. I have to play Sun Song no matter what. So the only time loss is that like three seconds of waiting. Hey. I've never had the Gwei follow me that far, and then he just kind of like said, "Hey, what's up?" and peaced out. Didn't even check. No one won yet. The run is not over. Remember, nothing is safe until Ganon. Nothing is... The run is still in danger until Ganon. Do not celebrate early. Am I robot miking?
Alright. Sloppier ending than I hoped for, but this should be sub 310. It is now safe. It is now highly unlikely for anything to kill the one. Alright. Sub 310. This run was... okay. Boss is super happy. Hey, Tapo. Glad I could make you happy. My adult section was actually still sloppier than I wanted. I, I feel like I consistently underperform in adult relative to like how much I practice it, but... Oh well. Up to adult was actually pretty good. Like, my biggest time loss was Dampe, which, I mean, obviously I can't do anything about. Actually, yeah, considering this was 6 try Dampe, this is decent. Bill can do better, though. Thanks, guys. Only one more milestone until the 3 turns into a 2. Although, uh, sub 3 is not likely with this route, but with if we get one more, like, decently significant route change, sub 3 is within the realm of possibility. Each run was okay, but I can still do better, and I will do better. How much can I still safety save? Uh, wait. Did you say safety save or actually time save? I didn't read that right. Safety save. I can't safety save at all in adult. Time save, um... Okay, let me see how much time I lost in adult, actually. Start of the adult, plus 530. I lost four... over four minutes in adult. Okay, dude. A good adult should lose maybe two minutes. So, okay. This adult was worse than I thought, actually. Like, with a really good adult section, I should save two more minutes, and then I got a minute and a half at Dampe. Actually, yeah, if I would get to adult, like, plus four minutes, and then... Plus two minutes from adult. Yeah, I guess 306. 306 is like ideal good time, I think. But that's like, I think 306 might be like on the really low end, like 307 might be more realistic. But uh, I'm gonna go for that. Button presses. Oh, button press milestone. Sub 9,000 eight presses. Guys, check this out, check this out. This is the coolest part of the hundo run. Check this out. I get black tunic. Yeah, because of some shenanigans the credits does to, like, attempt to force Kokiri Tunic on in the credits, uh, with a glitch tunic it ends up glitching your tunic in a different way, which changes it from C Tunic, which is the blue one I have on for the whole run, into D Tunic, which is a black tunic. What does black tunic do? Makes you look cool. Makes you look edgy. Turns on Linkin Park music in the background. Did I win? Kind of. I won as in I PB'd and I got sub 310. I lost because I was still sloppy. Wasn't that bad, but there are actually pretty good parts of this run, but uh, I can still do a lot better. I won't say it sucks, but it's not good either.